Are these guys coming? They they rushed to the border like they wanted some, and then they seen German troops come and they were just like, oh, well, you know, maybe we don't want any. And you don't want no part of this shit. Automa Yo, what is up, everybody? This is Boominati. What? Returning. With some Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiser Reich mod, throwing down our German Empire, episode number two. Picking up where we left off, which was we finally beat the French Commune. A war that seemed like it was going to never end, but we pulled out the victory. Went ahead and puppeted them because I didn't want to have to deal with the shit of the coastlines and the Britons and their navy and all that bullshit. Anyways, this episode we're going to focus on, I, I got a lot of things to do before the uh, war with the Union of Britain. I've got to build up my air force, I've got to clean up my infantry units, I got just all kinds of templates that are just total shit right now. I've got to rebuild my navy, and then we'll fit in the ass kicking of the Union of Britain. So let's go ahead and get this started. All right, we got Ned Flanders here trying to claim some area from our France puppet. Okay, gotta roll out with Ned Flanders. Ah, shit, we've got a revolt in Indochina. And like I said, I don't give a shit. I am not going to defend that. I've got my German people to worry about. You boys can have that and fight the French and um, Americans later on. Indochina is in full rebellion. N n I know. We have no choice but to let go. Damn, I lose a shitload of political power for letting go though. I have no choice, like it said. Wait till the... What is the elite African divisions arrive? Uh, bros, you are so late. The war has been over for a couple months now. The deal has been made. I have given up. Indochina colony. A new imperial state. A triple hurrah for the German Empire. The United Baltic Duchy is giving us some land. I will take it. Thank you. Everybody wants to be in the German Empire. Everybody. All right, so we got some free factories here from our newly acquired territory. As you can see, I'm still playing a massive game of catch-up from our... from our war effort with the French Commune. Um, I also got... I'm still building my navy, got it going strong. I'm only building subs and destroyers right now. I got a massive air battle in the English Channel, weakening them up, so I better put some of these into aircraft. Damn, the United States has capitulated. Who did they capitulate to? Oh, shit. It looks like the American Union state is um, going to get their ass kicked. And that's who we backed. You know, when they go syndicate, we're probably going to be forced to uh, fight them. So we might want to hurry up and get to England pretty quick. Have they joined with them yet? No, not yet. Nice! I was waiting for Switzerland to join the Kaiser Wilhelm Society. Damn, that makes my day. Kingdom of Siam declared a war on Indo-Chinese Union. Is that my territory? Yep. Good, I hope the Indo-Chinese Union gets their ass kicked. Bastards. We've got our first true panzer unit that we built ourselves. It is a good day. The Ottomans declared war on Yemen. I thought your empire was... I thought their empire was supposedly crumbling. They still look pretty good. 1934 Navy program. What should we focus on in the next six months? We're in 1940. We're talking about 1936. Yeah, I haven't done much with my Navy. 
Uh, right now, I'm focusing on U-boats and destroyers. I can't afford anything else at the moment. Uh, I guess U-boats. Ottomans beat Yemen. Got a little bit of land for themselves. Kingdom of Siam took seven states from Indo-Chinese Union. Ha! That's what you get. Damn, they didn't just take some. They took everything they had. The Russian Empire declared a war on the Socialist Republic of Georgia. Damn, the Russian Empire declared war on Azerbaijan now. They're just going at everybody. Pretty soon I'm going to have to defend the Ottomans. I'm trying to prop up an old power, an old ally. Might be a bad decision, but it feels right. The Russian Empire declared war on the Ma Klik. Damn, they are just rolling after everybody. I don't even know where they're located. I thought they were... Ah, oh, right here. Beating up on a bunch of little countries. What a bunch of bullies. Our old ally in the East has agreed to giving us oil shipments for a military expedition into the Near East. We'll send the boys back down. Reviewing the 1934 Navy program. You know, we went U-boats once. Let's go uh, destroyers once. And then after that, if it pops up again, we will go battleships. Well, why not? I'm getting a little bit closer to getting my shit together. Sweet! We finally got... Uh-oh, what happened? The death of Wilhelm II. We're on to Wilhelm III. All right. What I was trying to say is we finally got our upgraded Panzer. Now, I can, I can, what am I doing? I can trick it out a little bit. Yeah, what's up? I'm going to give it a good gun. Max out its gun, actually. Give a little bit in its armor, give a little bit of its engine. Its reliability is shit, but it has a great gun. Got me a brand new subtype. That's right, I'm upgrading my navy. Didn't think that was gonna happen, did ya? No big deal, whatever. I am having major problems with oil though. I am creating some synthetic oil factories, but uh, it's slow to catch up. But here in my production, I'm actually catching up pretty much everywhere. My tank production's still down. Everywhere else, I'm either got a pretty decent surplus or I am upgrading weaponry. Actually, I could take a few out of here and put them somewhere else at some point. Damn, now the Russian Empire's declaring war on Mongolia. Damn, that was quick. Mongolia was just like, here, take it. We don't want any problems. Got me a new fighter jet. Finally able to upgrade. I'm going to pimp this bitch out. Pimp my fighter jet. Why do I keep clicking on the wrong thing? Pimp my fighter jet. Let's see what we can do to this. Oh yeah, weapons max that shit out. Range, about a three. Engine, yeah, perfect. It's shit, it breaks down all the time, but it's, it's badass when it's working. Russian Empire took one state from Azerbaijan. That took you that long to... That's any indication of how well they're fighting, then I'm gonna have a cakewalk when I get to kicking their ass. Reviving the 1934 Navy program. All right, like I said, I guess we'll pick a pair of battleships this time around. Peace with honor. Since the fall of France, her forces unsuccessfully tried to gain control of the British Isles. Actually, I have not even tried. Unfortunately, resistance. I don't know what you're talking about. I haven't seen any. Uh, offer peace with honor. No, the war will continue until we march through London. That's what I'm going with. I've been building up for like over a year. My force is to invade England and I'm not going to stop now. The fall of Madrid. What? I didn't even know. Are you serious? This... 
I did not know that was still going on, and I thought the French War... I thought the French War lasted forever. I had stopped paying attention to that. I thought that was over. Kind of like this. Civil War over here. Oh! Damn, they're getting beat back, aren't they? That sucks. Finland wants to join Mittel Europa. Alright, if we accept... I mean, if that pisses Russia off, I'm really not ready for that. If that pisses Finland... You know what? Screw Russia. I'm accepting their offer. Come on in, bros. You are part of a brotherhood of Europa. We don't care what the Russians think. They don't matter to us. Hold on, what just happened? New war participant. The Russian Empire is justifying against us. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Damn, what's going on here? They look like they're gonna invade. Am I at war right now? What is going on? When that popped up, these guys rushed to the border like they're gonna side with Russia. All right, bros, if you come at us, you've, you've been warned. Like, I don't want to have to kick your ass, but you don't rush to your border like that. Especially when the border is up against mine. I don't take kindly to that type of shit. Guderian certainly doesn't take kindly to that shit. Ah, oh, shit, guys, here we go. White Ruthenia needs our help. The Russians are coming for him. They're buying up their bonds, trying to annex their country. Uh, we've we've got to. I mean, they're already. Hold on, what? Happened? I thought they were. They just had war goals against us coming up. What happened to that? Now it's like not up there. Well, you know what? You're still getting warned. Oh shit. They didn't like that. Never mind that. Let's go kick some ass. Oh crap. Um, I guess we're going to war with Russia now. I'll have to keep an eye on what these guys I didn't I don't understand what was up with those guys. My My infantry is not even in place yet. Whatever, I do what I want! Oh shit, somebody's already fighting. What's going on? Damn, Finland already took Petrograd. Leningrad. Kingdom of Finland has joined White Ruthenia as our ally in the final struggle. Well, besides this, I don't see any fighting. What is going on? Fine, I'll, I'll do it. We're in. For whatever that's worth. Still nobody's fighting though. Oh shit, everybody wants in now. Send some divisions. Wants a non-aggression pack. France wants in. You you're you're in, bros. If you want into the meat grinder. It's still like nothing's going on. Oh shit, now something's going on. Where were you when it happened? Uh yeah, we're we're yeah, we're at war. We are definitely at war now. Are these guys coming? They they rushed to the border like they wanted some, and then they seen German troops come in, and they were just like, oh, well, you know, maybe we don't want any. And you don't want no part of this shit. Ottomans send in volunteers. Lithuania wants to join the war. Whoever the hell that was. Ned Flanders. <gasps> oh, we're done for. We're done for. Looks like everybody's joining against the Russians. You you guys got anybody on your side? All right, let's go ahead and start up against the Russians, I guess. Shit. I got nothing better to do. Oh, look at that light up green. Russia. Not looking too good. Are you guys going to attack? Because you sure did look like you wanted some. You don't want this. Get out of here. I mean, I'm almost to my line right there. As soon as Guderian gets there, we'll see what the Russians are really, really like. Damn, Finland is kicking ass. Of course, Russia has... 
one troop there, so it's not that hard. But I'll give them props. They're still doing something. Dude, I'm kicking Russia's ass. I'm just just an ass kicking of epic proportions. All right, we are still kicking ass. Finland is still kicking ass. Oh, damn, we just filled up Guderian's army. He is completely full. Let's give him new orders because he doesn't look like he knows what the hell he's doing right now. Okay, we are to the front lines in most places with our Mr. Runestead. We're going to have to give him new orders. I guess you could say things are getting pretty serious. Damn, Finland's losing a little bit there, but they're kicking ass everywhere else. I might send my cavalry division up here. That might be a good idea. Go ahead and get them started up. My mountain division is here. Let's go ahead and get them started up. Let's go ahead and get Guderian started up. Where did I put these? I put them down here. Um, let's go ahead and pull them off. There. And put them up here. Alright, we're, we're, we're getting some W's down there. Actually, oh! Guderian! Keep the push! He's getting closer. He is getting closer. Ever so close. Alright, we got everybody going up here. Let's see if we can't push back their lines. Looks like we're... Looks like we're getting it done. The fall of Moscow! I love that. The situation in the Russian Empire appears dire indeed. That's right, because you, you just had to screw with us. You just couldn't leave it alone. We backed Finland. We backed White Ruthenia. Suck it. I'm just going to rush. I got um, Rommel here. He's got a couple units. I'm just going to send him at Leningrad. Damn, we're pushing good. The cavalry division is earning their keep. Damn, Finland is still going. I'm about ready to have to draw a new... Man, this is right now. And I don't want to jinx myself, but right now this is so much easier than the last time I went up against the Russians. I mean, shit, this is so much easier than going up against the French commune. Of course, I got a shitload more troops, too. We are definitely seeing some good wins up here. I'm hoping for a nice encirclement. I don't even have any uh, air power over here. I didn't even send any over here. It's still fighting the uh, Battle of Britain. We have made it to our line. Mr. Gert von Rundstedt needs new orders. New battle plan. I got gotcha, you, bro. Yeah, guess what? That front line. Let's grab these little cities in here. I mean, I'm going like big now. I've had such such good success. I might, you know, go big. Look at that front. Tell me that isn't a freaking battle. Tell me that isn't a Hitler-like battle plan. Just. Take everything. They see me rolling. They hate it. Damn, we're gonna take Leningrad back. Petrograd back, no problem. Up, we we are reviewing the 1934 program again. I'm going more battleships. You can never have enough battleships. Just like guns. You can never have enough guns, you can never have enough battleships. Damn, Finland has almost taken that completely out. We are almost back in Petrograd. The Mountain Division have has reached most of their um, goals. We're starting to get a push here for encirclement. Everything is good. I mean, I want you to take a look at the absolute ass kicking that we are inflicting on the Russians. 
Oh, uh, we got a little pocket here and a very, very small pocket there. Oh, Petrograd fell and it didn't even notify me. Bastards. I hope this gets over soon. We are running like shit low on artillery. Okay, it looks like most of them slipped out, but we are going to get at least a little bit of a pocket. Then we'll take Udarian and drive on Novogrod. Where is the defense, Russia? Here I was just like, holy shit, if France took that long, I, I'm scared of Russia, but no. Not at all. Alright, everybody got new plans. Let's, uh... Damn, Finland is just kicking ass up here. Let's go ahead and get this started. Let's watch this all turn green, shall we? Um, well, we got a couple greens. We're going to kick ass up here because there's no troops. So it's not going to turn green because there's nothing there. We do got uh, Guderian headed here to push uh, Novograd. So we'll see what he can do. Damn, I finally made it across this river. That's what was holding me up here for a long time. The mountain division might actually start doing some work now. I got Rommel's small group headed here to try to cut the Russians in half. We'll see if that works out. I could have put him here and tried a pincer maneuver, but uh, I've already made my decision. The Russian Empire has called the Serbian Republic as our enemy. Serbian Republic. I don't... Where even... Is that you? Who gives a shit? A, you can't even get to us. Go smoke a pole. D what? Look at that. How? How's that even possible? I've lost almost a million... Hey, I'm gonna call you guys. Come in, bros. I lost almost a million guys. What the hell? Shit's getting stirred up. I better hurry up and win this. I mean, look at this front line. Nothing, I mean, pretty much except for right in here. We got all greens going on. And it's just right in here because these are my marines. We are getting very close to their capital now. And in fact, my cavalry division has met their front line Pretty much. I'm not to switch up my orders again. Shit, even the Marines are getting in on it. Tunisia declared war on the French Republic. That is my bros. You can't do that. Oh my god, really? Why would you do that? Who is the guy that did that? Let's take a look at him. <laughs> that That looks like a guy that would make that stupid ass decision. All right, Rommel, you almost got him, bro. Oh my God, he is kicking their asses. Look at that. Come on, Rommel, we're watching you, bro. Split those Russian bastards in half. Come in. Oh, we did it. We did it. The Caucasus are now pretty much ours. See how Rommel does. He's down here. He's trying to clear out the Caucasus along with the Mountain Division. Looking pretty good. Mountain Division getting with it. Guderian's up here trying to take their uh, next capital. The country I thought was going to attack me and stab me in the back has been nothing but sending me troops this entire time. Oh, but don't forget. We are at war with the Serbian Republic. Look at this dick. Damn, Rommel only has eight panzers. I think two of them is motorized, and he's just kicking ass. Where's the notifications? Let me know when I snatch a capital. Damn, we are just kicking so much ass down here. It's not even funny. Damn, Fritch Republic kicked. Tunia's ass. Hey, what happened? Fifty-seven percent win rate. D 
Damn, the motorized division is kicking ass along with the panzer division. Garrison divisions, they're not even fighting. I don't even have them anywhere. Oh, what, what the hell is that up with that? I don't know. 1.65 million. Okay, we're, we're, I think we're catching up with them. They're about done. How many have I lost? Damn. This along with uh, the Commune of France? Shit, I've lost like 3 million men. Well, actually, I can check to see exactly how many. Well, about 4 million men. That's nice. I got a uh, Runestead's line set up all the way to the Urals. So we'll see how that goes. I can guarantee right about in here is probably the Marines. <laughs> yep, there they are. You guys suck so bad. I mean, I didn't really exp all, I, all I had them there was pretty much to hold the ground. I didn't expect too much out of them. The Caucasus front is about to fall the Mountain Division and Rommel's few panzers and motorized divisions are just absolutely wrecking what's left. They got 14 dudes there and they can't hold their shit. It's getting close. It's getting so close. Boom! The Caucasus have been overran. Oh, there's... You guys! Holy shit, look at the amount of troops they have right here. And There's like two guys here and they can't take it over. I'm not even helping you. That That's on you. Okay, right about now I don't know how the Russians are holding on. Oh, there they are. Okay, you know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to let my panzers handle this down here. Infantry up here and through here. And I'll have infantry backing them up, but it's mostly going to be a panzer affair. All right, let's get all these guys started up. Nice, nice greens. Except what happened here? Holy shit. What's up with all these reds? Uh, we've we've got we've got Guderian just murdering people here. Just absolute. It's not even fair. Actually, they're gonna get pocketed right here. We're back to reviewing. Same thing, bros. Same thing. Construct some battleships. Okay, now we're getting some more greens popping up. This is, uh, you can guess where the Marines are every time. They're right in there. E nope. Yep, there they are. Oh, we got a pocket. Guderian is not giving a shit right now. The war is coming along. Had to redo Guderian's front line a little bit. I was afraid he was going to get encircled. And down here where supplies is so shitty, he might not have got out. Come on, bros, I know the supplies are low. But you're almost there, so is theirs. They have no supplies. Oh, we're so close! If this doesn't end the war, I'm going to be so pissed. We got it! We got it, is that it? Oh my god, it's not. Are you serious? How? <laughs> just everybody go. I don't, I don't care what you're doing, just, just go. You've been sitting there doing nothing for so long. Just go. Go do something. We did it! Finally! Finally, the Russian Empire has capitulated. That is great news. Thank you. Holy shit. Kingdom of Finland. Kingdom of Ukraine. I didn't get shit. All I did was help them win the war. No biggie. That's fine. I, I won't have to put up with all the shit. Boom! Check that faction out! Hey, we still need to shit-can these guys. 
Okay, what's the final tallies? They lost 2 million, we lost 2.5 basically, and I lost almost 2. I lost more than... Okay, and how did, how did Finland only lose that? How did Ukraine only lose 37? They were fighting the whole damn time too. I lost 2 million, they lost 37,000. Hold on, I gotta check that again. Was it actually 30... It's actually 37,000. How? Fucking how? Anyways, bros, that is gonna wrap this video up. The Russians have been defeated, even though this was planned to be a beatdown of the Brits. How's the Civil War in the U.S. going? About the same as it looked last time. Anyways, if you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the shit all like and subscribe, and I will see you back here for our next upload. Peace. Ruminati out. <laughs>